LP Biali, Amy Roloff not settling for verbal promises, wants a written will from Matt, LPBW fans always wondered what the fate of Roloff Farms would be. Apparently, Matt didn't let any of his kids inherit the property, while Amy also doesn't own anything on the property anymore. So there was always a question mark when it came to the successors of this infamous 100-acre pumpkin farm. But Matt's recent announcement changed the air completely. He announced that whatever property he would have during his last days would go to Amy after his death. Matt believes that this would be the best option, or else everything will get complicated. The matriarch couldn't believe it and wasn't able to think what to reply to this shocking revelation. Amy admitted in her confessional segment that this sounded crazy. It was evident from her expressions that she didn't see this coming, and LPPD fans wondered if she was even able to believe Matt's words or not. The majority of viewers feel that Amy isn't able to accept her ex-husband's words, and she might want this assurance in a written form. Some LPBD fans even felt that Amy didn't seem to be really happy with this decision. This could be because there have been instances when Matt made verbal promises and didn't fulfill them later. That is why Little People Big World viewers now want Amy to have a written document that would bind Matt to stay on his word. As soon as Matt made an announcement of passing Roloff Farms to Amy, LPBW fans were curious to know Karen's reaction. They believed that the latter must have lost her nerves as she was watching this property slipping through her hands. But it appears that the table has completely turned as this whole idea and plan was of none other than Karen's. Karen said that she was the one who asked Matt to pass on Roloff Farms to Amy. She revealed it in her confessional segment. She explained the reason behind this as well. As per the celeb, the noted property was built by Amy and Matt in the past, and they have worked hard for it, even starting multiple businesses. Hence, Karen simply doesn't want to snatch it away from the people who built it. On the other hand, Karen also clarified that they were talking only about the Roloff Farms. This deal wouldn't include her and Matt's house in Arizona, because that is theirs. Hence, she made it clear that she wasn't having any issues with this major change and was fine with it.